Hey, 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 it's me again. That's right. It's the Brother Jaw Trucking Show, volume 15. And I'm going to keep on doing it. I just got to let you tell you something kind of funny. I got a Garmin. And I got this load to pick up here in Lakeland, Florida. And the address I put in there, it says, I don't know where to go. Pick up this trailer and head back to Jacksonville, Florida. It's going to be a trip. But hey, check it out, y'all. Well, thank y'all for being here. You know what it is. Keep it tuned right here. We're going to keep it rocking and rolling. And eventually, I'm going to put some mixes up in this thing and make it pop off like you know I can. So check it out. Ha-ha. That's right, y'all. It's another edition of the Brother Jaws Show. Check it out. Hey, guys. I just had a break. Guys. It was kind of weird, man. I'm in Florida right now. I'm coming out of Florida. Here, we're going to South Carolina after I pick up a trailer. That's why it's bouncing so much because I realized my hood and my front mirrors, they all bounce. This is Kenworth, 2016, and uh, it's I believe it's because when I'm tra I got a trailer, this stuff doesn't bounce like this so much. It's like, I don't know, kind of evens it out, you know? But I always just notice something kind of wild. I know you notice this too, especially as a driver. Okay, you ride down the highway, and you know, you do your best not to, you know, I would never hit anybody. I would never hit anybody. I always look at my mirrors and make sure I'm good. But man, these people out here, don't they don't know how to drive. I'm telling you, it's a trip. I'm like, yo, what? <laughs> you know, I mean, you put your blinker on, they act like you're stupid. Like, like, you know, you tell them what you're doing, and they just don't put, they don't put no blinker on, they don't do nothing. I mean, talk about making wide open for law enforcement. Oh my God, they don't gotta do anything. I mean, they just ride out here and look, and people just don't use blinkers, don't do nothing. You know, me and myself, I'm just doing the best I can, trying to be the best version of me I can. I'm just living my dream, living my life, trying to be happy. And I like being happy. I'm excited about happy because I get to drive, listen to music, whatever I want to listen to, YouTube, get on uh, get on the internet, you know, whatever I want to do, I can do it and know how to worry about it. But at the same time, it's really weird how watching people drive. That's why when I say I drive, I'm the only one knows how to drive. Everybody else don't know how to drive because I because if you're not watching them, they're definitely not watching you. Yes, that makes a lot of sense to me. And this, I, every time I see a car on the side of the road when I'm driving, I pull over to the next lane if I can to make sure I don't have a problem. Because what it boils down to is if, if you got a car that's broke down, you never know what's going to get out of that car. You never know what's going to run from that car. I mean, a little kid can get out of the car and run into the street and you, you smack, you, you, and you, it's unavoidable, but you still killed somebody. And that wouldn't be cool. I mean, I wouldn't want that feeling. I'm sure you wouldn't want that feeling. So, you know. But anyhow, guys, you know what it is. There's a lot of YouTubers out there, and I think it's really cool because I'm grateful that everybody's up there on the internet sharing their beliefs and philosophies and stuff like that, you know. And I think it's pretty awesome. I'm living the dream. I'm doing my thing. I like what I'm doing. I, this is not all. This is not just what I'm going to do. This is just what I'm doing now. This is allowing me to be able to move on and do other things. And eventually, you're going to know all about it. Just like when I get my equipment to do my DJ stuff, you know, I'm gonna start putting remixes on the internet and you know, make, make it palatable for the industry to appreciate it because we're promoting them, that's what we do. But at the same time, um, plus uh, there's just a lot of different things I wanna do and this is gonna allow me to accomplish these things. I'm sorry for the vibration people. It just so happened that that's my idiot thing telling me, oh, you moved over too much, dude. I'm like, whatever. Anyways. But um, that's why it's vibrating right now. But anyways, I just gotta let you know what's happening because I'm here and I'm gonna turn the camera around so you can see what's happening. Check it out. Ah! I cooperated finally. I was like, man, I'm like, hey, what's really good? But anyways, this is what Florida looks like. And Florida's pretty nice. I mean, I enjoy it. There's a lot of things going on in this world that I can't begin to talk about. But I'm sure as you investigate in the internet and everything else, you can figure it out too. But I'm gonna be the best version of me I can be and be happy as I can be because I'm following my passion. Because I learned a long time ago, from the air you breathe, to the food you eat, to the water you drink and take a shower with, to the drugs the pharmacy tells you to take, is out to kill this meat flesh, out to kill this body. So you really can't get away with anything, per se, because we don't get out of here alive, which uh, Red Viking Trucker always says, which I think is really cool. And Samuel, I think I, I don't know, I got heard Samuel Jackson say in one of his movies, I thought that was pretty cool. He sung a song about you never get out alive. We don't get out alive, it's pretty cool. But anyways, I'm going to continue to be the best version of me I can be. I want to thank you all for tuning in again. And uh, we're just going to keep it rocking and rolling. And if you feel so inspired to become a subscriber, go ahead and do that thing. Smash that like button. You know how it works. Get it popping. I want to thank you all for being here. I'll be the best version of me I can be. And I'm out. To the next 
episode, which will probably be in a moment. Later. Ha ha! Peace. It's a trip to the to air blowers. Serious air blowers. Be good or bad. Did you know it's not good for you to blow your hands dry? Maybe you should wipe that shit off. I Well, that's my French. That's me. I'm just walking out here showing you the truck stop, not truck stop, but this is a rest area. You see all the pretty trees, palm trees. It's kind of a trip. It's kind of very pretty out here. All the trucks out here, see? Yep, yeah, I'm going to head out back to the truck. I don't know what you can see, but I'm just being me. This is my brother, Jaw Truck Show, volume 15. I want to thank you all for being here. Like I said, I'm heading to Lakeland. Drop off this tractor, this trailer. Pick up a full trailer. It's a light load today. I got like two little under 400 miles. I'd like, I'd like to do a lot more miles. I wish my company would get off. I don't know, I wish they would just give me more miles. I'm all over the road guy. It just seems like I'm not getting the miles I want, but hopefully it'll all work out. Thank y'all for tuning in. Just remember to be the best version of you you can be. That's all I'm trying to do. Later. Ha <laughs> ha!